Hello, my name is Will Rookdi uh, from LifeBridge Church and University Place. Um, I just want to share a few things. Uh, I didn't grow up uh, in the church. I didn't have the greatest understanding of who Jesus was. I'd, I'd heard his name and, you know, I knew God's name was in the Pledge of Allegiance. Um, but, yeah, I didn't grow up with it. And then later on in life, um, I kind of had a little bit of an involvement with the church for a little while, but it was nothing serious, and it fizzled out and became nothing. And I really started to question God. And um, eventually I got married, and my wife, she had similar beliefs as far as God, like not real um, no faith whatsoever. And so it was pretty comical that my wife invited me to church. Um, it kind of came out of the blue. She went to a basketball group to go play basketball with some friends. And she, in that process, she met some people and they invited her to their house for dinner. And she asked me to go with her, uh, which was sort of a red flag there because she doesn't really like people normally. I'm just teasing, but you know, if you know her, you would understand what I'm saying. But so we went to do that and they invited us to church and my wife was like, hey, we should go. And I was like, okay, I mean, I'm, you're my wife, so I will follow. And uh, we show up there and first of all, it was a Saturday. Um, and I kind of thought, wow, this is, it's a little weird. And then, um, they were serving food and stuff, and come to find out, they're just a bunch of plant eaters. So I thought, wow, that's, this is kind of strange. What kind of a cult is this? Is this church or is this a cult? I, I don't know. And so it intrigued me enough to where I talked to some people and I wanted to get some more information. And uh, in that process, we got the chance to serve. Uh, we did a vision clinic, and during this time where I was for a few weeks where I was going to church and talking with people, I really was questioning God. And I was like, okay, God, if you're real, please show me, uh, show yourself, make yourself known. I really wanted to know who God was, um, if he was real. And if he wasn't real, tough. I'll keep going on with my life. It isn't too bad. And so went to serve at this vision clinic and we show up uh, about an hour before everyone was supposed to come. It was at least a hundred people that were going to come that we were going to serve and none of the equipment was there. All the equipment to test their eyesight and to test uh, all the things that the optometrists do, it was all gone and so we were kind of panic mode and I thought well that's tough. I mean logistically um, this isn't going to work and we prayed, people prayed. That was still new to me at that time and I thought okay well in my mind Show up, God, now's your chance. And an hour later, all this nice new equipment showed up from a totally new donor. Someone donated all this equipment, and it was just, it was incredible to see the logistically impossible come to fruition. Um, just all glory to God in that moment, and that definitely sparked um, my heart and my spirit and I knew, okay, all right, God, I'm picking it up. I see what you're doing. So that, that led to Bible studies and uh, seminars and different things and getting more involved in the church. And through that process, I was still questioning God. You know, I was still hungry for God, wanted to put more fuel on the fire. So I questioned him and time and time again, he kept coming through, kept revealing answers in the Bible. And so it got to the point where I was like, he is undeniable, so let's get baptized. And that was in June, got baptized with a lot of uh, some of the close people that helped me on my journey, um, and it was just a huge blessing, and now I'm excited to bring other people to know the truths that I now know, and uh, if you're questioning God, if you're questioning who He is, that's fine. Keep questioning Him, because I guarantee you He's going he's gonna to pull through. He always does. And uh, if you've already had your questions answered and you believe in God, it's time to share that with others.